would say my earliest memory would have been when I was playing t-ball. I remember getting to third base and uh, my dad coming up to me and actually taking me out of the game because I had chicken pox and I was I had chicken pox all over my arm apparently. Well, my earliest baseball memory is, is since my older brother uh, came um, all the way from Kerrville, Texas to stay with me for a week. It's him dragging me out when I was about six years old and playing catch with him. I was really little and I was kind of still learning the game and I'd go over to my grandparents' house uh, during the day and my grandma would take me out back. Uh, I think I was three years old in the backyard with my dad. It's with my dad, you know, before it was even organized. In the backyard with my mom or my dad, either of them could pitch and I had one of those big red wiffle ball bats. Uh, and they would throw for hours and hours and hours. They said I, they wouldn't let me, uh, or I wouldn't let them go in until until I hit for hours. And we'd have like these little like uh, like foam balls and like a little foam bat, and we'd actually put pillows out, like uh, outdoor pillows on the ground as bases. And so that's how I learned my one, two, threes. And I messed it up early. I'd, I'd run to third base every time, I guess, but uh, <laughs> I'd, instead of going to first. But yeah, I think my grandma's definitely the one who really got me uh, to get out there and start playing. Being like the bat boy, ball boy, whatever, for my older brothers who are uh, five and eight years older than me. And I was uh, just always around the baseball field, always running around uh, playing catch or, or doing whatever, just, just happy to be out there. My father taking me when I believe I was five or six years old to a game at Griffith Stadium. And all I remember is the, the green wall in right field, and I think it was Gene Woodling hit a, ending a home run. I didn't know who he was, but I, I, that's the only that was my first memory. Uh, probably is having snacks after the game. <laughs> uh, you know, you play, and you know, as a kid, you just go out there and you just have fun. And then after the game, you look forward to playing with your friends, hanging out. You know, having a little barbecue after the game, and you know, that was kind of a good memory for me to have. Is I was always just hanging out after games, you know, eating and just having fun.